Okay, so this is a uh, Burke Lake Park um, drone video. It's only five minutes, so enjoy. And um, uh, I'm playing the tape now. So basically, um, the drone is now um, on the floor waiting for command to take off. And here we go, the prop is spinning, and uh, right now it took off, and um, I'm at, uh, at the drum is at four feet feet uh, level, four feet of uh, height. So just a little bit of um, under, you know, my eyesight. And this is the boat ramp at, um, at uh, Burke Lake. It was a park boat, and it was removed for winter because of the snow condition. So, um... And you can see it, the floating dock is covered by the snow right now. And uh, you can also see some white snow on the far side and also on the shore. Um, so this is the uh, island and uh, across the um, boat ramp area. And this is my kayak. And, you know, I'm trying to turn around to show you the boat ramp area and this is a frozen piece let me uh, roll the tape backwards okay so you can see this is oops this is all frozen when I got here in the morning um, the lake was frozen above here so I need to push these ice away and luckily the wind was blowing to the left so I was able to push that um, thin ice away so I can launch my uh, kayak and here is the um, the uh, park uh, concession. Of course, it's closed. So now uh, my drum is uh, rising higher, and you can see the boat launch area of the park. And you can also see the tree behind it. So I'm adjusting the drone camera angle downwards so I can get a better angle of and this is the restroom and the vending machine and this is the chair at the boat ramp. Ah, that's me. So you can see um, it's an iPhone, so it's very uh, screen is very small. So I was looking down to uh, try to see what the drone is seeing, or what the drone camera is uh, filming. And you can see there's still patch of ice in the shallow area. And now um, the drone. Oh, there's a bird. There's a seagull just uh, flew um, past to the right. And you can see it continued to, oh, this is the uh, fish attractor here, Pui. So next time when you want to catch a fish, go there. Um, this area, it's very shallow. And this is the uh, park trail. You can see here, go to the left, go to the right. So this is the park trail. And uh, back to the um, road to the parking lot of the boat ramp. So you can see, um, and in the shallow area of the lake, it's covered by the, uh, there is me again and my uh, kayak and my SUV. You can see the shallow area is covered by thin ice as you can see here, this area, this whole area. It's all covered by the thin ice. Sorry, I uh, was moving too fast. So it's kind of easy. And you can see the surface, the lake surface is very smooth. There is uh, a little bit of breeze, but uh, no, not, not bad. Um, almost um, probably f less than five miles of wind. You know, so there is the fishing pier sticking to the middle of the lake. And at this end, I think it's about 20 feet deep in the lake. So, you know, and this is the park ramp. And these are the jumbo that, uh, and then they also store the jumbo behind the concession. Okay, so it's a very nice uh, lake, public lake. It's free to the uh, Fairfax resident, but it's not. Um, to it's it's uh, you need to pay if you are uh, a non uh, Fairfax resident. But uh, right now in winter time, the park is free to enter. There's no charge. Same thing. Um, the boat ramp. Uh, 
in the when the park uh, when when the concession is open when when the uh, rental uh, boat uh, is is open, then uh, there's a five dollar charge to launch your um, your boat or your canoe here. But um, in winter time, it's free. So you can see there's a chair there. There's a chair there. See that? And there's this. This is the um, uh, trail. You know. So it's kind of nice. You can go around the lake, um, uh, hike, and it takes about two hours to go around the lake to have a round trip hike. Um, if you walk quicker, probably you can do it in about an hour and a half. Okay, so it's a very nice lake. And this is, a, like I said, this is a photo taken from my um, Mavic Pro drone that I purchased uh, from an open box deal. So some of the parts are missing, but I don't care. So now I just descended, the drone just descended and returned to um, to me. I didn't want to run the battery down, so I only um, flew for about, you know, a little bit over five minutes. Okay, thanks for watching and please subscribe. And I just hand caught the uh, drone, it didn't land on the, um, floor, I uh, hand caught it.